Hey guys, welcome to my legal classes. This is Ganesh Pujari and in the series of Indian Penal Code, we were discussing chapter 10, which is all about of contents of the lawful authority of public servants covered between section 172 to 190. And in that series, this is my 11th video where we are going to cover section 181 in a single slide presentation, which is all about false statement on oath or affirmation to public servant or person authorized to administer an oath or affirmation. Let's try understand this with the help of a bare act provision and a beautiful simple chart in my next slide. Let's get into this slide. Section 181 of IPC discusses about false statement on oath or affirmation to public servant or person authorized to administer an oath or affirmation. Now here the bare act provision says whoever being legally bound by an oath or affirmation to state the truth on any subject to any public servant or other person authorized by law to administer such oath or affirmation, make to such public servant or the other person as aforesaid touching the subject any statement which is false and which he either knows or believes to be false or does not believe it to be true, shall be punished with imprisonment of either description for a term which may extend to three years and shall also be liable to fine. Quite an easy barrack provision. Let us try understand this more easily with the help of my chart. The class will continue. In between, I just wanted to share an important update with you guys. I have joined the Unacademy team as an educator for CLAT 2023 batch and I would like to request you all to download the Unacademy app and follow me there also. And while buying the subscription over there, please buy the subscription with my code GYAN07 that is GAN07 to get additional 10% discount. And what's happening in Unacademy this week? All India CLAT mock test series batch is starting from March 9th, 2022 and a batch by name Let's Crack CLAT is starting from March 11, 2022 and a rank booster advanced batch is starting from March 11, 2022. Join all these batches and while joining, please use my code that is GYAN07, GAN07 to get additional 10% discount. Thank you. We have gone through the Berak provision of section 181 and now let us try understand this particular Berak provision with the help of my simple and straight chart. The chart says, whoever being legally bound by an oath or affirmation to state the truth on any subject to any public servant or other person authorized by law to administer such oath or affirmation, makes an oath or affirmation knowing that or reason to believe that such information is false or he is knowing that or reason to believe that it is not true. In that case, such person is committing an offense and that is punishable. Okay, there is a person who is legally bound by the oath or affirmation which he has already given to a public servant or a legally authorized person. Okay, now after making such oath or affirmation, now he is giving a false information or he knows that maybe the information that he is giving false or he is giving such information that knowingly or he has a reason to believe that whatever information he is giving is not true. If he or she is doing so, in that case, it is a punishable offense. And what is the punishment? The punishment will be imprisonment of either description for a term which may extend to three years and shall also be liable to fine. Okay. It is imprisonment of either description okay it may be simple or rigorous and the imprisonment term can go up to three years and shall also be liable to fine he or she also need to pay fine for that offense and under crpc these are non-cognizable offense bailable offense and magistrate of the first class will conduct the trial that's all about section 181 and that's my time for this video I will see you guys in my next video with section 182 and for now, I am handing over the presentation to Nishan. With that, I am concluding this session. Please subscribe our channel. 
प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड कमेंट आवर वीडियोस थैंक यू बाय